Hello everybody and welcome back to Fallout 4 Episode 4. In the last episode, we killed a bunch of dudes and I'm just collecting their stuff. I'm doing the intro now in case, whilst I'm collecting this stuff, something tries to attack me or any other exciting things happen. Take it easy, Mama. You okay? I'm fine, Preston. Right oh. Awesome. So I did it. That was a pretty amazing display. I'm just glad you were on our side. Thanks, dude. I feel like I really put some hard work in slaying that huge, spiky, hairbrush loving thing. Stop kidding yourself. You're nothing to me. Hmm. You know, you talk like a jerk, but you still helped us out, whether you wanted to or not. Listen, when we first met, you said we owed you for helping us out. I guess you've earned it. So here. It may not be a chest full of emeralds, but it'll have to do. But I wanted a chest full of emeralds. That's weird. I'll take it. Didn't help for money or you're welcome. What is the most didn't help for the mo I don't want your money. I didn't do it for money. Hey, sorry. I'm used to everyone being in it only for themselves. You know, you remind me of my friends. Oh. The other Minutemen. The ones who gave their lives for something bigger than themselves. You should come with us to Sanctuary. We could use the help. Sanctuary! No. I got my own problems. Well, that much is true. Because <laughs> I seen your destiny. And I know your pain. Mike Krasowski. Don't give me that destiny crap. I just saw you go toe to toe with a 20 foot tall irradiated lizard. You telling me you can't keep an open mind after that? Nope. <laughs> it's all right, Preston. Not everyone understands the sight. But I don't need you to believe. I just need you to listen. You're a man out of time, out of hope. But all's not lost. I can feel your son's energy. He's alive. Ugh. Bullshit. You're trying to play me for a fool. Oh, no, kid. No. The sight's sometimes foggy, but it ain't ever a liar. Your son's out there. And even I don't need the sight to tell you where you should start looking. A great green jewel of the <laughs> Commonwealth. Diamond City. <laughs> Sorry. around. Diamond City? Uh, that's vague. You've told me nothing. It's all just guesswork. Look, kid, I'm tired now. Maybe you'll bring me some chems later. The site will paint a clearer picture. No. Mama Murphy, we talked about this. That junk. It's gonna kill you. Ah, shush, Preston. Ah, sure, We're all gonna scary. die eventually. <laughs> We're gonna need the sight. And our new friend here, he's gonna need it too. Now let's get going. Sanctuary awaits. All right, folks. He's giving me a dirty Thanks to our stir. friend here. It's safe to move out. We're heading for that place Mama Murphy knows about. Sanctuary. As you can see, I did Not some... Far. She knows about it? You mean she had one work. of her visions while she was stoned out of her gourd? And now you want us to just head out on another wild goose chase based on no better plan than Mama Murphy saw it? It can oh, hardly hold on, out hold on. worse than... Everybody just take it easy. We're all in this together. We're right. all so in Marcy, this together. Got a better idea of what we should do next? Anybody? Kill people? I do. I do. Well then. Ugh. Sanctuary it is. Let's just hope it lives up to its name. What is Come it? On, okay. Jane, it's time to go. Oh. Okay. They're related. He's messed up. He kind of looks like uh, Keanu Reeves if his face melted a little bit. <laughs> Jesus. Okay. I don't know where we're going. Where you need to uh, head. Apparently. Hold on to that power armor now. What you have to go first? See it go to rust. I want to go. Why do you have to go first? Thank you. All of this rubbish around here is what I threw away. Right behind you, boss. Why is no one armed? Apart from him and me. We're just going back up the road. Fast travel then. Why, why the hell are we waiting around? Boosh. Sweet. Workshop is the mission here. I take it we've got to repair this. Structures. 
decoration. Why did that come up and nothing else? So why are we here? What's the objective? Uh, hello. A little bit of help would be nice. I don't know what I'm doing. Oh my god, I got a hobo. Hello. Oh, it's Mama Murphy. What are you doing here? Mama Murphy. Sanctuary. I knew you'd join us here, kid. Your energy is tied to this place. Right. But that's because I was... That's because I was, like, born here. Well, well, I wasn't born here. I had a child here, and I have watermelons. Seems to be growing well. How do I have watermelons? You can plant watermelons? Okay, so I found out he's patrolling. <clears throat> I'm glad you decided to come with us. I should have listened to Mama Murphy all along. Pretty nice place she's found for us. I think we could settle down here. Make it a place to call home. What do you think? Uh, This isn't a home. It's nothing but an empty ruin. You've got to look past what it is to what it could be. We've got water, plenty of space. Should be pretty defensible. I can see it. Garden plots over there, some snug shelters. Hell, maybe even electricity. Impossible or hopeless? Hopeless. <laughs> You'll never rebuild this. Despair is easier, believe me. I know. But I've seen people come together to build a better world. That's what the men and men were all about. Before it all fell apart. Anyway, I am glad you're here. And I hope you don't mind. But I've got another favor to ask. I've had word from a settlement asking for help. They're still hoping there are Minutemen out there, somewhere. The only chance to start rebuilding the Minutemen is to show people that they can count on us when they need us. Trouble is, I've got my hands full here. Do you think you could go help out with the settlement? Uh, sarcasm. Oh, good. I was hoping for a chance to rescue some more helpless villagers. It's not that people are helpless. Yay. Need someone to give them a helping hand. Oh, them. level up. That's what the Minutemen are supposed to be Jesus. all about. By the way, if you want to help out around here at all, talk to Sturgis. I'm sure he'd be glad for all the help he can get. I like him because he's chipper, even though it's tough. And also, he's got a cool hat, like, from Jurassic Park. And he's got lovely blue and gold, like, royal clothing underneath. He's got fashion sense and is kind of a cool person, so I like him. I don't like people just on their fashion sense. <laughs> By the way, I'm not that shallow. But it's cool. It's cool. It's a cool, dude. And my melons are growing. I've... Just when you think you're safe, you're not. That's how they Jeez, always think. Please chill out. We got gourds now. Sweet. This place is flourishing. Hey Sturgis. Hey Sturgis. You wanted help? You willing to do some work? Yeah. I love work. I can sit and watch it all day. <laughs> well, for starters, we could use some real beds. We've been sleeping on the ground for too long. Do I look like a carpenter to you? I don't know what you look like. <laughs> I'm a chef. You're willing to help. Making beds is what we need help with. Do I look like a carpenter to you? Oh, you fine. What? Fine. I'd be glad to help. Okay. Good deal. Just make sure we can sleep with a roof over our heads. Some of these old houses still look solid enough to do the trick. There's a workbench over there you can use. Give me a holler if you need any. I need something. Build sheltered beds for sanctuary stuff. Okay, so what do we need for that? Sheltered beds. Let's do some renovations. Where should a bed go? This is the downstairs. We should really have an upstairs for this kind of thing. <laughs> yeah, that makes sense. Where's a hot... How do we get up there? Is my question. Because I haven't got a clue. Should we build... Let's build some stairs first. I feel like this is turning into The Sims. Oh wow, there is nothing up here. How do you actually get in? You can't get in. Great. Good, good job. <laughs> so much for the upstairs bet. Oh, eeny meeny miny mo. Which one should I go for? Uh, it's that one. Sweet! So I've just been doing some renovation, which I'm probably going to cut out because it's just putting in beds, a uh, water pump, and I've got some turrets above the porch here. But none of that's really that interesting, so we're going to go down to the main quest area, south, and uh, just see where it goes. I love these hunting rifles. It's not a long barrel, though, which I quite like. I'll take a paintbrush. I'll need that to renovate some houses. So where am I going? Uh, objectives this way. 
Let's go between these alleyways. We're gonna fight some horrible, horrible creatures, I believe. So I'm just doing some walking. As you can tell, I'm, I'm cutting bits out. Because walking across the wasteland when there's nothing going on is also a bit dull, unfortunately. <gasps> Wolfgang. Amadeus. We found some people. We wonder if they're friendly. Hand over the goods you owe us. I ain't giving you poison shilling chem pushers anything. Do you know what that junk has done to my boy? He bought them fair and square, Trudy. Ain't our fault if he's strung out. Now don't make me come in there and shoot up that little trading post of yours. I wonder if there's a friendly way to settle this. Whoa, whoa, easy there, Vault Boy. This doesn't involve you. You stop waving that gun in my face, or it's gonna involve me. Okay, okay, just take it easy. <laughs> we'll lower our weapons, all right? Just don't do anything crazy. Now hand over your money, all of it. Just keep calm, all right? Here, that's everything I have. Now get the hell out of here, both of you. You gotta be kidding me. <sighs> Fine. We'll leave. Just my goddamn luck. Ho oh, ho! Take that, punk! <laughs> Get out of town! <laughs> I won't wave my gun in front of you. Hi. Hey. Can't believe you made that scumbag turn tail and run. Here, this is for you. Sweet! Now you ever need to trade? My shop's open. Ho oh, ho! Nice! I'm a born survivor! I'm guessing that's just because I'm... You got um, things covered from here? Yeah. It's gonna take my son a while to get off the chems, but we'll make it. We always do. Now, let's get back to business. You need anything for the road? Jesus, she's cool. Uh... Sure. What's she got? Let's take a look. It's all worth every cap I'm charging. Um, armor-piercing submachine gun. Jeez. An alarm clock. That's that's definitely what I need. So that way I know when to end these episodes because I don't know. I really don't. This beer. Oh, brilliant. Biometric scanner. I thought that said a beard. Really? Waystall, have you made this game? We need that for the house. So I'm going to buy that. It's really lame, I know, but still. Frag mines. What is that? Why is it starred? Is it a, a, a legendary weapon or something? Total cost. How much is that going to be? Value. 1,500. Yeah, I can't afford that. Never mind. You, you can have that back. Good doing business with you, Trudes. I want to steal stuff, but I'm a good boy. I'm only mean in conversations. With the exception of if it's... Uh, oh, nice if it's um, beneficial to do it because of leveling up. Which reminds me... Gotta level up, baby! What should we do? Lead belly. That's the one we didn't do last time. Okay, that's sorted. I've got a horrible feeling we're gonna find mutants. I'm checking vats every now and then. Just to make sure. There's nothing lurking around a corner that we're not expecting. Like a rad roach. Oh, that's fine. I use my fists on it. I don't want to waste waste any. Uh... Actually, fine. Let's test this gun out. That's cool. Scavenge some places. See if there's anything worth looting. Probably not. Ammo. Toy rocket ship. The solid love that. I'm guessing he'd be like a hundred and he's already had kids of his own by now. That was a bad sound. Oh, there's loads of them. And I missed. Oh, it's only a three shot. Take that! Oh, I love that mode. It's just the, the kind of slow-mo shooting people in the face. Except they're not people. Out of ammo, which is a shame. Bad miss. Is that it? It's not spawning now. 
I don't know if rad roaches spawn the same way that the uh, mole rats did in the previous part. That was horrible. Fire support, listen to mis military frequency. Alright then. Radio. Automated message repeating. This is Scribe Halen of Reconnaissance Squad Gladius to any unit in transmission range. Authorization ARCS, Pharaoh 95. Our unit has sustained casualties and we're running low on supplies. We're requesting support or evac from our position at Cambridge Police Station. Automated message repeating. Okay, this that's gonna get annoying in a minute. <laughs> I'm guessing the other uh, stations are music, so I don't want to listen to them. As cool as it is, I don't want to get copyright infringement. Is this guy a Nazi? Look at that helmet. Glowing fungus. I'm guessing that's a bad thing to carry around with you. If it was in real life. These cars look just so cool. That looks like an A-Wing almost from Star Trek. Star Trek? Star Wars, don't hate me! Just a bit middled, mid, muddled my words. Middled my words, honestly. I'm doing that wrong. Oh god. I wonder if we can. Uh... Oh, this is gonna be horrible if this goes wrong. I'm gonna save it, in fact. Where's the mine? There. I'm gonna disarm it. Oh! Oh, there's another one. Oh my god, how many are there? Lucky I turned on vats at that time. I could have walked straight into that. I'm gonna keep looking with vats to make sure. Because one where there's one mine, there's bound to be another, right? Someone's having a cool firefight. Should we can poke in and then at the end of that finish this episode? Cool. Jesus. Oh my god. Are you guys okay? I'm guessing I could have saved that guy. Oh, he's alive! I need intruder alert. Do not give up, do they? Oh, yeah. Is he dead? Nope. Oh, another one. Oh god, they don't stop coming. Got enough ammo, thank god. Oh my lord. It's like left dead. Oh god. No, 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 no. That's insane. You still alive? Oh no, you've not got a head. I'm just gonna take everything off you guys. Thanks for the fight, it was cool. Oh god, dear lord, that was. What the hell's blown up? Is that just what they were attacking? That's insane. Oh. Okay. We appreciate the assistance, civilian. But what's your business? Um, hold on. Looting things. Uh, what's my bis business? Pest exterminator. I heard you had a feral problem. Evading my questions is a surefire way of getting yourself ejected from the compound. Are you from a local settlement? Yeah. Do all these questions really matter? After all, I help you fight those ferals. You make a fair point. If I appear suspicious, it's because our mission here has been difficult. Since the moment we arrived in the Commonwealth, we've been constantly under fire. If you want to continue pitching in, we could use an extra gun on our side. That all depends. How much are you paying? So you're a mercenary. Typical. Fine. You help us, and I'll see you're compensated Whoop. for your services. I'm Paladin Dance, Brotherhood of Steel. Over there is Scribe Halen and Knight Reese. We're on recon duty. But I'm down a man and our supplies are running low. I've been trying to send a distress call to my superiors, but the signal's too weak to reach them. Sir, 
If I may. Hello. Proceed, Aylin. I've modified the radio tower on the roof of the police station, but I'm afraid it just isn't enough. What we need is something that will boost the signal. Our target is ArcJet Systems, and it contains the technology we need, the deep range transmitter. We infiltrate the facility, secure the transmitter, and bring it back here. So what do you say? You willing to lend the Brotherhood of Steel a hand? He looks like a cross between Dan Gucci, or Gushy, or whatever the hell his name is, and, um... It's a good plan. If we make it back, I can assure you that I wouldn't undertake this mission. And Adam Kovic. <laughs> oh no, it's the guy from friggin' uh, the, 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 uh, uh, oh, it's a new girl, the the, the dude, hey, Reese, the bartender. Find his wounds. Yes, sir. Reese, once you're on your feet, <gasps> I want you to make certain that perimeter. Oh, I'm an idiot. I'm I really am. All right. So Thanks for watching episode I'm three, where we just kicked booty. Take that, ferals. Then let me know when you, you know nothing. Again. Oh, are we supposed to listen to that? Sorry. Um, give me, give me this. No, I don't want to. There we go. <laughs> I don't want to pickpocket him. I just want to take his meds. Level up. That's three in one le uh, one episode. Fantastic, guys. We're doing awesome. Um. Okay, so I'm gonna go for this intimidation. Time to show everyone who's the boss. With your gun, aim at any human opponent below your level, and gain a chance to pacify them purely because it'll be funny. Um and just see everyone quiver and feel like the other guy. I think every part of this Let's Play is going to end with me being over-encumbered. <laughs> so I have to go back either way. So thank you for watching. See you next time in the wasteland. A little less annotation and a little more clicking, please. All this post-production is sending me crazy.